Hi, I'm your coach, Nick Orduna, and we're going to God's Word to see how the faithfulness of God helps you win today. Today, we gather to reflect upon a topic that has plagued humanity, the dangers of lust. We are bombarded in a world that is filled with messages of pleasure and instant gratification. As believers, we must understand the profound consequences of allowing lust to take root in our hearts. Lust is a distorted desire, a craving for the temporary pleasures of this world that ultimately leads to spiritual decay and distance from our Creator. It is not merely confined to just physical attraction, but extends to include desires for power, wealth, and indulgences in all forms. Lust blinds us to the truth, leading us down paths of destruction and immorality. Scripture warns us repeatedly about the danger of succumbing to lustful desires. In the book of James, we are reminded that each person is tempted when they are dragged away by their own evil desire and enticed. Then, after desire is conceived, it gives birth to sin, and sin, when it is full grown, gives birth to death. James 1, 14 and 15. This warning illustrates the progression from temptation to sin to eventual spiritual death that leads to the indulgence of lust. The teachings of Jesus himself caution us against the allure of lust. In the Sermon on the Mount, he declares, But I tell you that anyone who looks at a woman lustfully has already committed adultery with her in his heart. Matthew 5, 28. This verse shows the significance of guarding not only our actions, but also our thoughts and intentions. The consequences of yielding to lust are great. It sows seeds of difficulty in relationships with betrayal and brokenness. It robs us of our inner peace and contentment, leaving us in a constant state of dissatisfaction and longing. It hurts our witness as followers of Christ. Ultimately, it separates us from the abundant life that God desires for each of us, replacing joy with emptiness and purpose with aimlessness. However, in the darkness of temptation, there is hope. Through the power of Christ, we can overcome the grip of lust and find true freedom in Him. As the Apostle Paul writes, For freedom Christ has set us free. Stand firm, therefore, and do not submit again to a yoke of slavery. Galatians 5.1 By surrendering our hearts to Him, we can experience the transformative power of His love, which quenches the flames of desire and fills us with a deep abiding satisfaction that surpasses all worldly pleasures. Let us heed the warnings of Scripture and guard our hearts diligently against the dangers of lust. So here is your final challenge for today. Fix your eyes upon Jesus, the author and perfecter of your faith, and allow His Spirit to guide you in the paths of righteousness. Think through your day and pray that He would grant you strength in His grace to resist temptation and pursue holiness in every aspect of your life. Remember, in Him alone lies the fulfillment of your deepest desires. May the Lord grant us wisdom and discernment as we navigate the dangerous waters of temptation, and may His grace sustain us in our journey toward purity. Now go and win today.